Hi, it's Dominic. If you are into AI images, AI influencers, and the latest in the AI world, you're in the right place. Let's dive in. In today's video, I want to show you a very specific use case of AI influencers. I will show you how you can place several AI models of your choice into one image, a crook shot, so to speak. Now you probably ask yourself why you would even need that. Well, that's quite simple. Sooner or later, you will be collaborating with other AI models or even companies that that have their own AI influencers, or even better, you have several AI influencer accounts that you operate. And then it's a very powerful skill if you know how to combine all these models in one image. Because with group shots, you have completely new opportunities to tell a story of a real digital life. And this is exactly what we learn in this video. So let's waste no further time and jump right to my screen. Good, as you can see, I prepared a little presentation to show you step by step how you can create a group shot of two different AI influencers. As you can see, I have two example models prepared. We have model one, I called her Maya on the left side, and we have model two, I called her Natalia on the right side. And let's imagine we create images of these two models on a regular basis. But now we want to create a group shot with both of them in one image. And this is exactly what we do now. So the first step is obviously, step number one, writing a prompt for the group image. And when we look at the prompt, a hyper-realistic image of a beautiful 24-year-old Dutch girl with brown hair, wearing an elegant white swimsuit, and a beautiful 24-year-old Swedish girl with blonde hair, wearing an elegant black swimsuit, group image two girls infinity pool rooftop that sounds like a normal prompt but there are some differences which we have to take into account for example i place the description how each model looks and what she's wearing into a bracket to make sure the ai understands how each model actually looks like what she's wearing and how she's positioned. Then I also added group image and two girls to give the AI even more information to make sure we get 100% a group image of two people and not a weird mixture of one person with all these features. This is very important. And then in the end of the prompt, I also added information about the background in this example, a infinity pool and a rooftop. And with that prompt, we can go over to the AI image tool that we use also to create the images of our normal AI influencers. For that particular example, I used Flux 1.1 Pro Ultra via Replicate, but of course you can use any other AI image tool as well. So let's go over to step number two. And as you can see here, I created the group shot, as I told you with Flux. And as we can see in the image, it looks quite nice. We have the background, we have the girls positioned. They are exactly wearing what I defined in the prompt. And they also look quite similar as I had this in mind. But as we can see here on the left and right side, they are not looking exactly like our example AI influencers. And this is exactly where the challenge begins. Because now we have to do a face swap, but we have to make sure that the right model gets the right face. We want the model on the left side with the face of the girl you see on the top left corner. And we want the girl on the right side to have the face of the girl you see at the top right corner. And to do that, we have to apply a little trick and that is to separate the image into two different pieces. So as you can see now, we have on the left side model one as one separate image and on the right side model two also as one separate image. On the top left and top right corner, you see the faces of our example AI influencers. And in the next step, our goal is to take these faces and put them exactly on the right model. And this is what we do now. So we go over to step number four, and here we apply the face swap. As you can see, now the faces are completely changed. I will jump between these two slides so that you see the difference. And I think we can agree that this face swap turned out quite well. My favorite method of doing a face swap is using the Inside Face Swap app on Discord because you get daily 25 free credits and you can use this completely for free and then applying a second face swap using Focus, which is also completely for free. So this is the method I use. And if you don't know how this works, make sure to check out my other videos because I already created several other videos exactly about that face swap. Good, now we have the two halves of our group image. 
And as you can imagine, now there's just one step missing. And that is step number five, where we combine the two pieces of our image to put it together to the final group shot. And now, as you can see, we have the two girls positioned in the infinity pool with the background and exactly the faces of our AI influencers. And on the next slide, you see, I just repeated the process and now our two girls are in a restaurant and dressed very beautiful, appropriate for a restaurant like that. And as you can imagine, with that method, you can tell a complete story about the holiday of these girls or what they are doing whatsoever. So this is very powerful. And this is exactly why I created that video. Keep in mind that I didn't do too much editing in these images. Normally I would adjust also the bodies and the hair a little bit more using in painting in focus. But for that video, I just wanted to show you how to create the group shot in general. If you are looking for even more information about exactly that, creating AI influencers and so on, make sure to check out my entire channel because I already created several other videos and tutorials about exactly these kinds of topic. And if you want to go even deeper, make sure to visit my website germanaicreator.com. There you will find entire step-by-step -step courses that show you in-depth step-by-step how to create an AI influencer and also how to turn it into a business. Good, that's it for today's video. Thanks a lot for sticking around and watching the entire video. I hope you got a lot of value out of it. If so, make sure to leave a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and let me know in the comments if you already tested out this method or if you even have your own method of creating group shots of several AI influencers. I hope we see each other in the next video. Take care and goodbye.